How many times have you wanted to see what's behind you on your bike, but you didn't want a mirror? Well, we've got the solution for you. This is Evan from Cerevelum. Evan, you've created a product a lot of us have talked about creating before. <laughs> Explain what it is we're looking at. Uh, you're actually looking at the digital rear view mirror for bicycles. Uh, it incorporates a seven function wireless cyclometer and the ability to record any incidents that may happen. Basically the system works by a 10 minute uh, constant video loop and if there's an accident the integrated accelerometer is tripped and you're left with a video file showing whatever happened leading up to the incident. You just download it to your PC or Mac and it sees it as an AVI file. Now this is something, like I said, I think a lot of us have talked about before. Mm -hmm. And I wonder, was there a genesis of this idea? Where did it come from? Uh, it came while I was studying industrial design. I uh, Basically, it was a school project. And I came up with the idea. I was racing at the time and just figured, hey, I'll take this uh, camera lens and mount it on my, screen, or on my bike. Uh, it worked really well. I continued working on it, doing prototypes using Nintendo Game Boys as screens. It was really hacked together. And then about three years ago, while I was out training, I got smacked by a car pretty good. And uh, that was pretty much the catalyst to start making a company of this and really bring it to market. Now you mentioned it's a cyclometer and I see it says Ant Plus on it. Mm -hmm. what, what does that mean to someone who has a power meter, a heart rate monitor, other Ant Plus devices? Okay. Uh, we focused a lot on the hardware and software of the device and we've basically created our own operating system that's uh, it's basically like Apple in the sense that you can add apps to it. So it's, it's very uh, expandable and upgradable. So a person that has a PowerTap or SRM that, that's AMP based, they can uh, basically download an app through our website. It basically updates the, uh, the operating system itself and allows them to view their data on the, on the product. So live on the screen is everything that's going on behind you get into an incident or an accident, it'll automatically record it, or if something happens and you the accelerometer hasn't kicked in, you can push a button so it'll keep the last 10 minutes. What other kinds of info will people see on the screen? Uh, they're gonna see the standard, pretty much the standard seven seven functions, you know, wireless, or uh, not wireless, but uh, it is wireless, it's ant wireless. Uh, speed, distance, time, time of day, uh, but they're also going to be able to manually stop the recording. So if a car buzzes you, or let's say you just won the finish, finish, uh, finishing sprint in the Tuesday night world championships, then you're gonna have the last 10 minutes of that video data and you just hook it up to your computer. Yeah, really nice. Now the screen itself, you were telling us earlier, mm -hmm. is innovative. I think the word you used was transflective. Tell us about that. Yes, it's transflective. Uh, as it is in, this, in the show hall right now, it's completely illuminated by LEDs and that's just because we're inside. Now if you go outside, the LEDs turn off because it's actually using the sun's rays to illuminate it. Uh, basically the sun's rays come in, they hit the back part of the screen, and they reflect back up and that's what illuminates the screen. So you can see it in broad sunny conditions. And if you go through like a canopy of trees, you'll see the screen get dark for a second and then lighten as the, uh, the automatic contrast and brightness kicks in from the camera software. It's, it's like magic. Yes. <laughs> What about battery life? Because we're talking about uh, video data, mm -hmm. uh, we're talking about reading Ant Plus, and then of course uh, the, the issue of illumination of the screen when you're mm -hmm. in a darker area. What kind of battery life can someone expect? About six to seven hours in like a normal sunny conditions where the backlight isn't on. Um, it varies a little bit if you've got the integrated tail light on, uh, but usually about seven hours. Uh, it's got an 800 megahertz processor, which is running really hard to flip the video, to save the video, and then display it. So we've got a lot of horsepower backed up in the uh, hardware. Speaking of horsepower, I, I know that there's a lot more to this product. Mm -hmm. If people want more information, where, th where can they go to get it? Uh, Cerebellum, it's just like Cerebellum, but with a V. Very good, and, and one last thing, retail price on the product? $299. Great deal on a product I think we've all thought about. I'm on camera now, I was on camera before, and pretty soon, cameras, cars behind you will be as well. This is David for Interbike TV.